Dragi prijatelji, danas 9. februara počelo je suđenje Brajanu Volšu u okrugu Norfolk kod Bostona. Najverovatnije zbog COVID režima koji još uvek traje iz bezbednostnih razloga u Sjedinjenim državama, Brajan se na ovom suđenju nije pojavio lično, već je putem Zoom aplikacije komunicirao sa tužilaštvom i sa sudom iz svog zatvora gde se nalazi. Naravno, pojavio se u naranđastom zatvorskom kombinezonu koji je u stvari odlika onih osuđenika za koje je predviđena kazna doživotna i tome slično. Jedina teža boja je crvena, a to je za zatvorenike gde je predviđena smrtna kazna. U ovom slučaju Brian nosi najteži i najopasniji dres koji u Americi nose najteži osuđenici za ubistva, silovatelji dece, hanibali, pedofili i serijske ubice. Meni je moja prijateljica Kristi Baram iz Amerike omogućila da gledam tok ovog suđenja putem Zoom linka. I ovom prilikom joj se zahvaljujem. Thank you, Kristi. I sada ćemo videti kako je to izgledalo. All right, good morning, ladies and gentlemen. This is the uh, video conference session, uh, February 9th, 2023, with Judge Horingen on the bench. Uh, we have Denham House of Correction joining us at 9.30. We're waiting for Mr. Walsh to join us in the Zoom room. Okay. Good morning, Counselor. Good morning, Your Honor. The parties that identify themselves for the record, Mr. Walsh is now appearing. Your Honor, Greg Connor for the Commonwealth. Your Honor, Tracy Minor for Brian Walsh. And Brian Walsh is on the video as well. See, Mr. Walsh, okay. Mr. Walsh, can you hear us okay? Yes, I can, thank you. So these are the matters of 230136 and 230318 uh, on for status hearings this morning. Okay. Your Honor, I was assigned to the matter last week. I've uh, been able to duplicate uh, all of the discovery that's not subject to grand jury process. I'm going to send that to Ms. Minor this afternoon when I get out of court. Uh, I'd be asking for a continuance on today's hearing. My expectation is that this matter will be finished in the grand jury uh, by the end of March, but hopefully mid-March. Um, so I would do whatever is agreeable to Ms. Minor for the next day. Attorney Minor? Uh, Your Honor, we... I will say we have received very little discovery to date, um, so I'm hoping that, that the discovery will be fulsome. We've received, like, basically nothing. Um, I have no problem with putting it on for a month, but, um, and I hope to be, uh, in fact, e even sooner, because if, in fact, we get all of the discovery, that's one thing, but if there's still discovery issues, if we haven't even received the search warrants um, for my client's car, the, the inventories for search warrants, I mean, the basic stuff that we should have had, um, like, immediately, we don't have. So I'm a little bit skeptical that this um, that the discovery is going to be fulsome or that it's going to contain everything I need. So if we could have a, a date like three weeks out, I would for another status conference, just so I can review the discovery, see what is missing, if anything. Hopefully not. But I believe that's a reasonable request, and I think three days, and we'll review discovery. I do ask both parties to work uh, to get all discovery. Wednesday, March 1st. By Zoom, please. By Zoom. Thank you so much, Your Honor. All right, Mr. Walsh, these matters are going to be continued to March 1st. Uh, we put them up for probable cause or status. I was going to ask for status. Please, Ms. Minor, I'll mention just that. Any objection, Ms. Minor? No, I'm, I'm happy to have one more status before we get to probable cause. I'll put it up for status. Thank you. March 1st for status. Mr. Walsh, you remain held without bail of 500000 on the other case. All set with us here today. Thank you.
Kao što ste videli, Brian delo je pomalo zbunjen. Kao da se probudio i sna i sada gleda neku pozorišnu predstavu koja se dešava oko njega. Imam utisak kao da ne znam šta se u stvari dešava s njim. Ne znam šta vi mislite, ali napišite vaše mišljenje u komentaru svakako. Teo bi da napomenem da je do odlaganja pripremnog ročišta došlo iz razloga zato što policija nije tužilaštvu dostavila kompletnu listu dokaznog materijala koji tereti Brajana Volša za krivično delo ubistva njegove supruge Ane Volš. I zato je e, njegova advokatica tražila tri nedelje odlaganja. Sledeće ročište je zakazano za 1. mart. I mi sa nestrpljenjem očekujemo nastavak ovog sudskog procesa koji će se isto prenositi Zoom aplikacijom. Moram sada za kraj da vam kažem da kada sam video Brian kako izgleda i kakav je njegov izraz lica, imam utisak da on i njegova odbrana pripremaju sistem odbrane da ga prikažu neuračunljivim, sa čime se ja apsolutno ne slažem. I mislim da im to neće baš tako lako proći. Na kraju krajeva i ovde u Srbiji je jako teško dokazati neurašunljivost, pa mislim da je u Americi možda još i teže. Raduje me samo činjenica da će mu suditi velika porota, zato što je veliku porotu nemoguće podkupiti i lobirati. A već se pričaju neke nezvanične priče da iranska emigracija u Americi lobira da se Brian Walsh proglasi neuračunljivim. I svakako napišite mi u vašim komentarima vaše mišljenje u vezi ovoga što ste videli, a mi se vidimo u sledećim čudnim pričama. A do tada ja vas pozdravljam.